Hello YouTube and welcome to another Textlaws unboxing video. I got a DHL Express package from China and in here is the brand new OnePlus X smartphone. Ta-da, ta-da! A nice air package here. Let's get it out. Oh, this is tight. So, and as you can see, you have also ordered a case because the OnePlus X got a not non-removable backside cover. It's now a glass cover like like an older iPhone models. But you can order uh, order cases, and I ordered for 20 euros. I ordered a sandstone case so that I get my originally um, OnePlus feeling here. But uh, of course, you are interested in the device itself. But first of all, let's go around, get a, let's go around the package here. We got the OnePlus logo on the front, and we got this X here on the side we see one plus X nothing here one plus X again and nothing here on the back side we see our in the informations on X version 16 gigabytes we got include one plus X USB cable charger uh, protective case and sim tray ejector networks uh, and that's it now open up the box shake it shake it and there we go Ooh, i see some air bubbles um nice packaging nice presentation of a new smartphone let's get the nexus 5 a little bit farther further away i just uh, got it for comparison but first of all one plus x presentation this is nice nice box nice presentation nice style to present your new smartphone on this not really red carpet but red box design uh let's get it out here put it ooh, lighter than it i would have expected uh, put it aside and let's, let's see what else is in the box. We got first level. How to open it up here. And then we can pull something out. Ooh, so there we go. Nothing more in here. No. We got our SIM card tray tool. And we got this other case. So you get one case with your OnePlus X. And this is only your nah, blurry uh, rubbery or silicon case okay but it's but it's nice that they give you a uh, that they give you a case so second level we got I guess we get some instruction manuals or so oh this way open it up and we can see it's a quick start guide uh, and we got a user guide and user guide is not really giving us much information no quick starter guide is giving us at least a picture of the smartphone there's our sim card tray tool for a nano sim and it's a combination tool with also a micro sd place because this is the first oneplus device with a micro sd slot uh, volume button power button and the alert slider and some ZAR values and this is it not really a starter guide in my opinion what else is in the box? We got, of course, the flat red OnePlus charging cable or USB cable, normal USB port. And let's see what we got here because no, it's micro USB, no USB C for the OnePlus X. Sorry, guys and girls. And the last thing we got our OnePlus designed charger, one USB port, white red design. And we got the output uh, of 5 volt 2 ampere. So this is it. The box is empty. Now let's grab the OnePlus X and get up the protection screen here. One and another one beneath here. Ah, there we go. Ooh, looks glossy and fingerprint friendly, or not so friendly. And on the back side again remove the screen protection and ooh, feels nice and there we go this is the first one plus device with this glass backside no more sandstone feeling on your smartphone at least until you get the sandstone cover a uh, case uh, so we got this one plus logo on the backside everything is glossy of course it's a fingerprint magnet we got our camera and our led flash and notice one thing the camera fits totally inside the the case so no camera standing out of the smartphone on front we got our front-facing webcam or uh, camera 
uh, speaker one and no home button, no sensors here. Um, on top, uh, on the button, we got a uh, microphone, speaker and of course our micro USB port. On the right side, we got our volume uh, on off button and then we got our volume bar. And I have to say, I can reach both or all three buttons without any problems. This is really nice. This is well placed here because I can reach it without uh, moving the phone inside of my hand. We got our nano micro SD slot here. We got on top, we got a microphone, another microphone and the headphone jack is on top and I really like it there. And on the left side, we got our uh, alert slider here. We got one position, a middle position and a top position. Okay, but this one I can't. Uh, no, this I have to, to operate with my other hand or I have to uh, move my hand or have to move the phone inside of my or to another position. No, this is not placed well up on top here. More in the middle would be better. Uh, we got the button and that's it. First impression, nice. Feels sturdy, feels well built. Definitely a nice build quality. Nothing moves, no, no, no. Really nice first impression here. And for, for size comparison, I just uh, got my old Google Nexus 5 for comparison and of course the new, or not of course but the Google Nexus 5 is a little bit shorter but also a little bit brighter yes it's definitely wider, wider I wanted to say and for another comparison device let's grab the Motorola Moto G third generation device and again no this one the, the Moto the Moto is uh, longer definitely and the motor is of course not of course but yes the form of the motor of course it's also wider so in direct comparison you got a slim device here with uh, with one plus x and i'm really looking forward to testing this device out and um, playing around with it and tell you what do you get for 270 euros and of course, I've uh, still got the OnePlus 2, which I did not unbox. But uh, first of all, I now I'm one of the first to get the OnePlus X. So I will test this one out first and later, of course, uh, the OnePlus 2 and do a little comparison. And of course, a lot of comparison with other devices in this price range. This is it, guys. Thank you for watching and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye.